experiment which we are going to are going to see is the aim of the experiment is write a program in java to implement extend so you might have studied in uh, D about the extend what will what is the objective of this is that we are going to, we are supposed to create a class of a uh, player which will give basic which will have the basic information of a player of like name age and skill uh, so what we are going to do is that we are going to create three classes which are going to get inherit uh, the player class first we will create a player class uh, it will have the name age and the skill three variables will be there and attributes of this class or these three variables of the class will get extend to uh, football player cricket player and the hockey player so what i did is i had uh, created game class it is a basic class which i had created and added this line so what we are going to do is that we are going to create a class of uh, a player so this will have it, let it have the variable name which will which is of type string it will have the integer of name and it is have a variable uh, or skill which is of type string now what we are supposed to do is that we are supposed to create three classes so let's create a class of uh, say first class is of uh, football what we need to do is that this football should have all these three variables so instead of writing uh, instead of writing a new class what we do is that we extend it extends uh, which class so it is player class so that's it so what will happen in this is that all the all the variables or all the attributes of this class will get inherited in this football class we'll have another class a uh, cricket same thing we we can do it extends uh, it will extend the player it's simple so another class will be there say hockey so here it will be hockey the class football class cricket and class hockey are the extension of this player so what will happen all these variables will get inherited in this three class let's come to the main class so here what we are going to do is that we are going to create the objects of football cricket and hockey let's create it so we created that we are supposed to create one more object to take an input from a user so we create like this scanner and this object is will help us to take an input from a user uh, then uh, obviously we are having multiple choices so we should have the integers to take an choice from the user so i will create op option one and option two uh, what i will do is that i will uh, continuously ask the user to whether he want to enter the information or he want to display the information so for that purpose what i'll have is that i will have a while loop and it will be continuous so i will write true so i created the while loop so two is small okay so first uh, i will ask the user to enter its choice whether he want to enter the details display the details or you want to exit enter one to enter details two to display details and three to exit i display the message so that user will understand what he is supposed to do so i will take an um, option from the user so it will be option one is equal to input dot next thing okay so once we got options so we are supposed to use switch case switch case uh, on option one okay so we are having three cases so one so i will take it case two and case three in case uh, in case of three uh, what we are supposed to do is that we are supposed to exit 
from all okay so i will have a system dot hexi with zero a case one is for entering the details of the player i will give a choice to the user i will ask user to enter one for ticket player for say uh, the first is for football player second one is for click ticket player and third one is for hockey player so i had given place to the user so i will take an place from a user option 2 is equal to input dot next hint this will take an uh, option from user so again i'm supposed to have a switch case switch on option 2 i have three cases case 1 case 2 case 3 so three cases i have in case 1 what i'll have is that i will take name age and uh, skill of football player so what i'll do is that i will ask user to enter the name first system i'll take a name and it is of fb football fb dot name is equal to input dot next so it will take the name from the user then i will take a last to enter age i had asked user to enter age so i will take age now age is equal to input dot next now it is integer so i will write int and okay then i will take uh, skill so i will ask user to enter skill uh, dot then uh, enter skill yeah, i will write enter so fp dot skill is equal to input next now here i am taking things so i will not write in like this i will take uh, the information of users uh, information from user for football player similarly i will take from for cricket so now here i will change to ck so for cricket ck because i had created object of cricket as ck so in the case 3 i will take of hockey so hk i created like this in the case 2 what i'll do is that i will ask uh, i will display this information so first i will ask user whose information you want to display so enter one for football two for cricket and three for hockey now again i am supposed to have a switch case so i will have here I will take an uh, input from user, it will be stored in option 2. So it is, is equal to now it is integer. So I will have this. Okay, so now here again it will be uh, switch, switch case. So switch on option 2. I will have three cases case 1. We always write break because uh, even though we desire switch. Uh, on case one if we forget forget to write break it will uh, it will go to the case two so you have to write this and this is case three so three cases we had written in the case one it will display the information of football player it will display the information system dot out dot print ln name of name is so what is the name it is say uh, now we are writing for football right so it is fb dot name so after that i will write system out dot print ln h is fb dot h and system dot out dot print ln skill is fb dot skill so this is this we written for football similarly we are supposed to write for cricket so here i will make change ck here i will write for okay. like this uh, the program will be there if i'll run this here it will ask to enter option 
So what I want to do is that I want to enter the details. Okay, so I want enter the detail of football player. What is the name? Say ABC. Age say 26. And skill is say XY. Okay. okay. Now what I want to do is that I want to display this. Okay. So for football I will display. My interesting thing if I want to uh, say display the user. Okay. I want to display. And I want to display for cricket. So it is showing null, zero, and the null. So I haven't entered the anything over here. So for this purpose, we should have the exception handling because it does not have anything. 